Let's explore on how to connect GoDaddy domain to GitHub pages. Let's begin. Now make sure you already have an account created on GitHub now. If by any chance you haven't done so, this is the perfect time for you to do it. As you can see, you can just sign up for GitHub or start a free enterprise trial, whichever the case may be. Now, let's click on sign up for GitHub. Obviously, you need to enter the work email or business email for you to move forward. And once you have prov provided that, click on continue. Now, once you are on your main dashboard for the GitHub page, it will involve updating the DNS settings for your domain. Now, you need to create first a new repository on GitHub where you will host your static website content and make sure your HTML, CSS, and other necessary files are part of this all right now go on and create your first repository here click on that now this is the fun part wherein you can choose to be it public or private and again this is going to be a new name for that it's andy's guides and repository name which is it's up to you So I leave it as is for now and choose um, you might want to choose uh, the uh, branch you want to use for github pages usually main or master and obviously you need to create click on the create repository okay now after that now log into your GoDaddy account and it's the first um, step is to click on the upper right corner of your profile and click on all products and services. Now once you are here, go to domains and click on manage all. What will happen is once you click manage DNS, you need to hover down here at the very bottom wherein it says connect your domain because automatically it can forward your domain to an existing website. Of course, we are going to GitHub pages, right? Now, all I'm going to do is click on connect my site. Now, these are the platforms and websites that um, GoDaddy can integrate and connect to easily. We have here a lot, which is Tumblr, Weebly, Wix, Squarespace, WordPress, WeddingWare, Medium, Eventbrite, and a lot more. Or you also have the uh, social sites such as Facebook, LinkedIn, Twitter, Pinterest, and House. And also some um, online e-commerce stores such as Shopify, Etsy, eBay, Amazon. Even media sites such as Flickr, YouTube, Instagram, and Smug. Mug. Alright. Now you can also forward to any site at the very bottom and then just click on domain. That's if you are. It's a more advanced um, uh, tutorial for in our next video. But for now... If by any chance you can find GitHub here, you might want to go back and head over to uh, GitHub where it says for us to order to set up GoDaddy domain for a GitHub page, all we got to do is create a new file CNAME and put the uh, domain.com in the file. All right. So again, if you're still following, you need to log into your GoDaddy account, which we did earlier. Go to manage domain. And then you need to go to DNS zone file. Basically under a host, change at point to these numbers. And under CNAME alias, change www.website.github.io. Alright, and also if you want to just click on GitHub pages plus GoDaddy here. Now as we mentioned earlier, all we're going to do is choose CNAME because we're creating a new file. And put the domain name here. All right, it's up to you. And of course, the value that you wanted. And just leave uh, the TTL um, as default. And again, under a host, change at point to these numbers, which is 192.30.252.153. And under CNAME, alias, change triple W dot point to website dot github dot io all right that's basically how you do it connecting godaddy domain to github pages is that easy thank you so much for watching and we will see you again in the next one